You are listening to Bedtime Dreamy Tales. Please make sure you have subscribed to our channel for new story. Story title, The Peasant's Wise Daughter. In the heart of a kingdom where rivers wound like silver snakes and mountains pierced the skies, there lived a humble peasant named Thomas and his daughter, Lily, whose wisdom was spoken of in hushed tones even in the farthest corners of the land. Their home, though filled with love, lacked the bounty of the earth, for they owned not a sliver of land to till. One crisp morning, Lily, with the spark of detonation in her eyes, proposed, Father, let us seek the audience of our benevolent king. Perhaps he would grant us a patch of barren land, a canvas upon which we can paint our efforts and hopes. Thomas, inspired by his daughter's vision, agreed. Presented before the king, their request comma, simple yet bold, moved the monarch. Touched by their plight and Lily's evident wisdom, he bestowed upon them a piece of land, barren to the above rich in potential. With spirits high and dreams fueling their days, Thomas and Lily worked the land. Their toil was rewarded not just with the promise of harvest, but with the discovery most unexpected, a mortar of purest gold hidden beneath the earth, as if waiting for hands worthy to uncover it. Thomas, ever grateful for the king's generosity, insisted on offering the golden mortar as a token of their gratitude. Lily, however, cautioned her father, the gift may lead the king to expect his companion, the pestle. Silence, sometimes, is the wiser offering. But Thomas, bound by a sense of honor, approached the king with the mortar. The king, intrigued by the gift and perhaps by the mystery it hinted at, demanded the pestle. When Thomas confessed there was none, he was cast into the depths of the dungeon, a prisoner until he could present the missing half of the pair. In his cell, he lamented, his cries echoing the wise words of his daughter he had chosen to ignore. Word of her father's plight reached Lily, who, undeterred by the grim news, saw a glimmer of hope. She presented herself before the king, who was quick to recognize the flame of wisdom in her eyes. If you are as clever as they say, he declared, solve this riddle, and not only will your father be freed, but you shall become my queen. The challenge was to approach him in a manner that was neither clothed nor unclothed, neither walking nor riding, and neither on the road nor off it. With a mind as sharp as the edge of a sword, Lily embraced the riddle. She shed her garments, enveloping herself in a fishnet, thus not naked nor truly clothed, she found a donkey, tying the net to his tail, and thus she was dragged neither walking nor riding. She maneuvered so that only her big toe touched the ground, placing her neither on the road nor off it. When she appeared before the king in such a guise, he laughed, a sound of genuine delight and admiration. True to his word, he freed Thomas, married Lily, and entrusted her with the stewardship of the realm. Years of prosperity and peace followed, with Lily's wisdom guiding the kingdom. Yet. Peace was disturbed when a dispute over a newborn foe erupted among the peasants. The king's judgment, clouded by the letter of the law, failed to see the spirit of justice, awarding the foe to the wrong party. Undaunted, Lily devised a plan, instructing a wrong peasant to cast nets on dry land, mimicking fishing. When the king inquired about this peculiar sight, the peasant's reply mirrored the absurdity of a cow birthing a foal, highlighting the folly of the king's judgment without disrespect. Realizing the depth of Lily's wisdom and her role in the clever rebuke, the king confronted her. Angered and feeling betrayed, he ordered her return to her humble origins, allowing her to take only what she cherished most. In a twist befitting tales of old, Lily chose her husband, the king, as her if most like treasured story, possession. By please drugging give him this video, she and like his peaceful and comment below with your thoughts. Modest home. See you in Awaken the next story. In unfamiliar surroundings. The king's initial confusion turns to awe as he realized the depth of Lily's love and wisdom. Overwhelmed by her devotion, he proclaimed, In wisdom and in love, we are bound for all our days. Together, they returned to the castle, their bond stronger, and the kingdom once more under the wise and loving rule of the peasant's wise daughter. Thus, the tale of the peasant's wise daughter endures, a testament to the power of wisdom, the strength of character, and the enduring nature of love.